Hello everyone. Welcome to the show interview with founders and influencers. Today we have with us Mr. Arun Garg. Mr. Arun Garg is the founder of the Institute Coaching Select and uh, he has been working on it very hard. So welcome to the show Mr. Arun. Thank you. Thank you Keshav for bringing me here. Uh, how are you? I am fine. How are you? Uh, good. Thank you. So can you tell us more about your startup like what you are working on? Yeah, thanks Kishu for asking. So Coaching Select is a one-stop solution for the coaching institutes. Let's say you uh, currently we do have portal for everything. Like when it comes to and forth, we'll, uh, uh, the first name it's come in my mind is Safegees MATO. When it has come to FMCG, Amazon, Flipkart, uh, Misho is there. So there is no portal available for the student where they can have uh, the information on the coaching institute. They can search the online, offline blended coachings from their uh, mobile device or from the computer. They either have to visit the coaching institute or they have to call for the all the information. So there's a lot of logistic uh, behind it. To solve that problem, we have come up with a coaching select where a student can select any category uh, coaching like this, JE, NEED, UPSC, CAT, MBA, etc. And with particular city or online, then the entire list will turn up and they can see what the information they want like about us when they have established what is a student faculty ratio faculties facilities result testimonial as well as they'll get an uh, idea from the previous alumni of that student uh, coaching and the uh, beauty of the uh, product is that they can purchase the uh, coaching courses at a discounted price so prior they have to pay full fee whatever the coaching Ah, so now the coaching is individually uh, giving the huge uh, scholarship and discount so that uh, it saves the parents' pocket and they can purchase it at a lucrative discount rate from the coaching select and start learning from the neighbor. Yes, yeah, so that's a very great idea. I think you are working on. Uh, so I don't know what does success look like for your company. So uh, the idea came in my mind around two, two three years back. Uh, we have launched our MPV in 2022. And in last one year, we have an overwhelmed response from the student size. Uh, every month, some around one and a half lakh student visit our website. We'll get in 50,000 signups every month. And uh, 1,100 coachings is being listed as of now which serving uh, almost uh, 28 to 30 categories, inclusive K-12, post that uh, test prep, et cetera. So this is the journey so far. And we have done so many, achieved so many milestones and recognition and awards. We have incubated in Jabalpur Incubation Center, uh, uh, recognized by Startup India, I Start, Goa Institute of Management, et cetera. Yeah, that's wonderful. So, uh, can you tell us about any big risk that you have taken in your journey when so, you uh, working on your yeah, startup? So I can say entrepreneurship is all about the risk. If you not a manage the risk, uh, you will not uh, come in this field because it's completely uh, a sleepless night. You have to work uh, round the clock. There is no fixed hours. You have to manage the PNL. You may have to match the uh, other's expectation. You have to run your as well as the other houses. You have to give the salaries. So the risk is that I was doing very well in the corporate industry, uh, having a lucrative package as per the market is standard. So I left uh, uh, because of my passion and to serve the student because at tech is uh, always at the bottom of my heart. So. I can say that risk is every day. Uh, whenever you're not able to make a so-called big brand where everything has been streamlined and go into a pilot mode, uh, till that risk is there. And I can yeah. say that uh, even that, there is a risk. Yeah, you sure took a big risk for this. Right. So, yeah. Arun, what is your biggest achievement till now? Achievement is that I do have various uh, achievements through academics in corporate, uh, in a startup as well. So I'll love to talk about more about the startup. So uh, when we have launched, uh, there was no portal available. Even to uh, give the, uh, we have to educate the coaching industry as well as the student that 
this can be done because there was an a uh, traditional method was going on that is rent follow that huge they'll influence by an marketing advertisement which comes on the front page within huge rank 1 rank 2 they'll uh, their siblings uh, had already uh, enrolled themselves in those coachings and maybe have a good experience so student thought that why not but uh, every student is different as uh, yeah. as as my perception as my knowledge of last 14 years everyone has a different requirements everyone has a different pace of learning so when it comes to an coaching institute a student must be very particular about its requirement they not think that everybody is doing while well, not me so they have to introspect what exactly they want what is their expectation are they want a good study material they want a learning environment they want a close set or they will enable within a huge audience where they are learning with a set where uh, the mind pace of imbibing things are not similar yeah you were right so when you achievement you that. can say that uh, yeah so achievement is that we have launched and we'll got a very good response from the market sooner we'll have an clients like resonance motion class plus etc so in a small span of time we have very good success rate it is accepted by the students and the coaching institute we got too much love from the uh, community as well so uh, for this you will feel good uh, whenever you are doing whatever the cause will when you are working towards particular cause and you are solving it you always feel uh, good yeah you are right about that that every student is unique in their own way right you are right about mm-hmm. that. so i don't according to you what is the important quality that every founder should have the uh, there is in must the patience the enthusiasm and the passion any founder these kind of things must uh, have inside any of the founder because uh, whenever if you're not patient will you have a short term goal that i'll if you're not able to reach that much at particular point of time i'll quit then this will not happen in a founder's journey and you must have open you you'll make sure that no stone under maybe the, your efforts it's it's kinding and fitting and seeds for an up bamboo tree it, when you are growing that you'll say that i'll have an a uh, uh, huge 100 feet bamboo tree in a uh, 3 or 4 months this will not this will take another 4 to 5 years so you must be patient you must be passion and enthusiasm about the idea at least you must convinced by yourself what exactly you are doing after that you can talk to others and able to uh, make them friendly about your idea and the cause which you are working towards it the secondly is that you have to think like a customer it is not that like you are thinking that it is a fantastic idea and you will not get a market fit so you have to work for a market fit product market fit pmf so that you first prior to launch an idea you must have an good research good product market fit you could uh, feedbacks from the community as well as from the customer sides while before launch yeah you're right about that so are how do you make sure that your team works together ah uh, it's a very difficult question i can say that uh, <laughs> you have to create an uh, uh, environment where that everyone feels uh, like an uh, entrepreneur in your organization if you will always be feel that you are always right whatever you will say your team has to be done then you will be limit yourself so to open and to grow a company you must any once idea and once uh, mind can't be extended expendable you must have to be good friendly amiable with your team members and get an idea you must have know what exactly what you want to achieve and what's the path but how it to be driven it's by the team yeah right sir what makes you think out of the box means like uh, any how- unique thoughts that the unique thoughts that like uh, uh, you must follow uh there something unique but maybe don't think that uh, this can't be done before or no one has thought because uh in an uh, entrepreneurship around 
i can say everyone has an uh, there is no time that anyone has no idea to launch it it is maybe that uh, it is not their time or they are not able to make it into end business so it may be that something come in your my uh, their mind and or your mind but not be launched so work towards it and think that it is possible or it is workable so possible and workable are the two things that uh, you can say that everything is possible but everything is workable is not around 99% of the business in current scenario failed only 1% succeed and after out of that there are the lot of stories going that there is a uh, funding there is an a uh, kind of a founding team there is an a uh, product market fit there is an a uh, kind of response and or also the time maybe someone has tried prior to covid and just covid came up maybe they have some uh, have launched post covid which re- has a requirement pre covid or during the covid so depends are you right about that tarun they will play a game with you but before that do you want to give any tips to the young entrepreneurs i can say that uh, everyone has to taste this journey it's very very enjoyable because you are a free man of doing whatever you can so uh, even if india is an emerging population there uh, a youngest uh, or you can say teenagers are doing lot of startup india has an eco friendly startup system uh, so if you think that your idea can change the society and impact on society as well as helping them or you can make money out of it why not so thank you arun so let's start the game so i will tell you the dialogues of a movie in english and you have to guess the name of the movie okay so are you ready okay okay so the yes. first dialogue is the movie is not over yet my friend the movie is not over yet my friend in hindi you can no. say picture abhi baki hai mere dost okay okay <laughs> yes okay so Sorry. what's the movie name yeah uh, i remembered the dialogue uh, it's an old movie i not remembered the name of that movie but uh, i must saw it yeah it was om shanti om shahrukh khan and deepika yes okay so yes, yes. Second... no 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 i remember now i remember okay yeah sometimes it gets tough so actually okay so there is a rule of friendship no sorry no thank you uh kuch kuch hota hai no uh friendship mein sorry nahi hota it's used in many movies i guess after that dialogue um, yeah <laughs> it is on, i hard in on every movie beginning of that uh, i will give you a hint so sorry again so, i'm not get that i will give you a hint so it's the kabutar ja ja the book has kabutar ja ja okay ja ja okay uh, that salman khan and uh, uh, bhageshri is the heroine <laughs> yeah but uh, not remembering the movie name yeah, I, i saw right. that movie hard that so yeah yeah you are right up to that extent it's the maine pyar kiya maine pyar kiya yeah so uh, the third one is sometimes to win something you have to lose the something तो जीतने के लिए Uh, so the hint is uh, four friends one who cannot speak four friends one not one able to speak one cannot speak yeah first part 
first part uh, okay welcome nahi no 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 not welcome mm, it was it was comedy movie na Okay, so uh, oh. I will tell you the actor's name. So it was Ajay Devgan, Tushar uh, Kapoor. Ah, Ashad Varsi, Tushar yeah. Kapoor. I've seen two, three times that movie. Uh, it's a very good movie. Yeah. Okay, so heroine was uh, that Rimi Singh. Rimi Singh. Rimi. And the name was Paresh Rawal too. Uh, the second one is when Pariniti Chopra in the same set. No, not uh, that one. Not that one. Yes, the the. Sorry, not able to click that name. Golmal. It's. Golmal. Golmal, yes. Yeah. So it was fun playing game with you. Yes, 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 yes. It was really. But uh, I'm not uh, remembering too much name of Bollywood and Hollywood. Yeah, you might be busy with because... your <laughs> company, so you don't get time yeah. to watch movies at all. It's it's not like that. Uh, I'll make sure that uh, every week or a month we we'll complete uh, at least one or two movies. Uh, go to uh, friends, watch at the theater or watch at Netflix Prime. But yeah, uh, sometimes time is not allowed. It's a random one. Last question. So, what is your inspiration? Please. My inspiration is uh like uh to. It's not particular a person. It's it's uh, even my uh inspiration is on hard work where you can do something if you have an capability to achieve. at particular pace of time by your own and by connecting people and driving them for a, a similar goal where everyone feeling proud and happy during the journey is my goal yeah. and inspiration is like uh, uh, a very uh, new founders like bhavesh agarwal uh, of ola recently i uh, read his post a twitter post when uh, uh one of the founder said that india uh, is not uh, a country where it is an electro, uh, electric vehicle driven so he has uh, himself open an ola electric and it's a huge success now so uh, that kind of founders always uh, give inspiration to you uh, during your journey that uh, if they are able to make it why you not yeah So thank you Arun, so, uh, for coming. So when, whenever that like you are challenging uh, people like Elon Musk uh, over a Twitter that no, if you're not able to make it in India, I'll. Do it. So is this thing that will not rely on the outsource? We can make our own. Yes, so thank you Arun for coming to our show. Thank you. Thank you for giving us your thank time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.